Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name is Ken. Today's experiment is the singing glass toothpick mover. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is two wine glasses, water, and a toothpick. To start off with this experiment, uh, we're going to try to get the same pitch in the glass. So starting off with the same amount of liquid, dip your finger in and go circular motion all the way around on both glasses. And if you hear the same pitch, then you're pretty much set and you're ready to go. Now you're ready to go. So you take your toothpick and put it on the end of one of the wine glasses. Make sure the wine glasses aren't touching each other. Dip your finger in like we did earlier and start rubbing in a circular motion around the outside of the glass. And you'll see that it's going to move the toothpick. Well, why does the toothpick fall into the glass? Well, you rub your finger on the rim. First, your finger sticks to the glass, and then it slides. The stick and slide action occurs at very short lengths and produces a vibration inside the glass, which in turn produces a sound. As soon as the first few vibrations are produced, the water in the glass starts to vibrate and creates a clear tone. You can change the pitch, the high to low of the sound, by adding and subtracting amount of water in each glass. The volume can be changed only by a bit by increasing or decreasing the pressure of your finger. The movement of the toothpick is caused by a synthetic vibration. Because you've made sure both glasses vibrate at the same exact frequency, the sound waves produced the first glass travel in every direction. When those sound waves are reached to the second glass, the glass begins to vibrate as well, and the toothpick moves. Is it magic trick? Nope. It's just some really awesome science. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Okay, you're on the video.